commentary on the AKS-74U uh, for Pixel Revive. Thought I'd uh, throw my name out there, see if I'm worthy enough to be on a Pixel Revive uh, commentary session here. And uh, I'm going to just be playing here and giving you a little commentary. I do uh, a lot of commentaries on uh, my channel. You guys should definitely check it out if you want to see some more. I'm going to be running up here and I'm going to quickly go for some frags, getting the flank on behind, trying to get that B site. See a guy in the top, take him out. Now the tips and things I wanted to point out to you guys is you got to click shoot a lot of times. Now I, I know I sprayed there, but that was a panic attack. Guy right in front of me hiding in a corner, a little noob there. I had to take him out with a spray there. You guys know how it is. I'm going to quickly grab this gun, drop me an ammo pack, and go back right for my weapon. Move to the side here. I'm going to quickly use the click shoot. And this is what I'm talking about. If you guys click shoot, you'll definitely take out a lot of guys. And the next thing I want to point out to you guys is you want to check your corners. Always make sure to check those and use your teammates to your advantage. You do a little Batman bit of Superman jump down here. Take out these two guys because you know how it is. That's how we do it around here. You gotta take out those guys as soon as we see them. And here's the next point I want to point out. When you see your teammates, a lot of them on one side, most likely the enemy's on the other side. So you want to quickly move back, and that's what I'm doing right here. I'm quickly turning around, I'm going to go back to the side. And what do you know, there's a medic right there. Go right for the knife, make him look stupid while I'm at it. I'm going to quickly move to the side here. I'm going to be moving up and trying to get that sight straight ahead. And I quickly, you can see there, I play it a little bit military style. You got to check your corners and you got to play it smart. Make sure you clean out one bit at a time before you move up. Just get those clean out sides. And I managed to get myself a combat excellence pin right at the top. And I'm click shooting the whole time. You can see it. I love this weapon simply because of its uh, fact that when you click shoot, it does a lot more damage than it would if you were spraying. I find that if you spray a uh, clip of 30, it would actually end up uh, being a clip of 15 because the second shot after your first shot misses. But if you end up click shooting every single shot hits, I can't emphasize that enough. And hey, if you click shoot fast enough and you know how to control that recoil, you can pretty much make it an automatic click shooting uh, weapon. And uh, I'm going to quickly check out my corners here. Like I mentioned earlier, you got to check your corners. Wanted to make sure it's clean. Now this part is pretty funny. That I don't know what that pilot was doing going real low. Decided to take a rocket. Missed him. These two guys jump out. I quickly start shooting at them. And this second guy, I'm going to pull out my uh, gun at him. And it looks like I shoot him in the knee. But I like to think of it as I shot him in the nuts. No homo, just so you guys know. It just looks funny when he gets taken down like that. I quickly go for cover. Here's another tip I want to point out. As you're reloading, don't be in the open to reload. You guys probably already know this, but you know what? It's good to get a quick reminder of it. I'm going to move in here because I hear a guy to the side. I have no clue why my teammate's not using his sound to hear the guys off to the side here. I'm going to quickly shoot at that guy. And here's the panic attack. Try to shoot him. Try to knife him. I don't know why it didn't register. It completely looked like it did. And uh, managed to shoot him down. I take this man's weapon, I'm going to look around and see what's happening. And I uh, might as well start introducing myself now since it's going to be a little bit of running around before you see some more action. Uh, so like I said, my name is Doom49. I do do a lot of commentaries on Battlefield 2. Uh, definitely love this game. I'm going to be doing a lot of uh, commentary for uh, Battlefield 3 and when that comes up. Sorry, did I say Battlefield 2 before? I meant to say Bad Company 2. And, uh, yeah, I definitely do a lot of these commentaries. I like to give a little tips and uh, pointers out. So if you guys want to see it, I do. I do something sometimes a lot of random stuff. Uh, do uh, like I go out there with a sniping rifle and use a red dot scope as it and uh, point out some things that you can do. I definitely love uh, to use teamwork and uh, move out here. Now, as I was saying, I'm going to get back into the commentary on this part here. So I'm going into the heli. I'm going to start flying because I definitely love flying the heli. I'm going to be showing you a little clips here where I do some nice moves. But as I'm flying, I get taken down by a C4 from a base raping noob. Now, this totally pisses me off. And I'm thinking, i got to take this guy out before he does any more damage. And you can see he's running away. He's trying to destroy the death cam. Now, that's pretty smart in the fact that he moves from his old position to kill the death cam. But if you pay attention to the far left of the screen right there you just saw him running and in my head I'm thinking I gotta take this guy down the best way to humiliate him is right there I'm gonna drive him over make him look stupid while I'm at it there you go now I don't care how many things you can do when you 
get gayed like that from a base scraper, the best thing you can ever do is drive them over, and it just felt so good right there for me. I don't care if I had a C4 or a weapon, I'd definitely rather drive them over. Now I'm going to quickly go into the heli and fly it. Now uh, you're going to see me do a seat switch, and uh, on my channel I have a uh, tutorial for how to do these seat switches and the proper technique for taking down helis in a 1v2 situation. So you guys should definitely check that out. I'm going to quickly see shoot at the enemy there. I seat switch, try to shoot at him, and I quickly switch back and start shooting down on him. Um, I got a little bit more uh, flying around to do here and uh, breaking a lot more guys. My squad member is going to uh, spawn on me and we're going to end up taking on a lot more guys. I think I ended up finishing uh, this uh, match going 36-6. Uh, and six. Uh, Pretty much, uh, I definitely uh, laid down the Hilo Hellfire and that's what I like to call those uh, rockets as I go flying around. And uh, little techniques I like to do is I definitely love to do this uh, straight technique on the tanks. Uh, in my tutorial on my channel, I can tell you guys to do, uh, do that strafe, so I'm going to be showing it here in uh, action, where you definitely got to strafe around on those tanks. And what I know uh, the best thing to do for taking out tanks is to actually lay high and be above them, because uh, their gun turret on the top cannot aim any higher. So as long as you're above them and doing the turns as I'm doing right here, they end up being stuck. And most, most of the time, the smart players will move back and uh, go to the side and try to take you out. Uh, you can see there, that guy I, I, uh, kept spinning there uh, because uh, when you kill a tank, you're going to get 100 points, but depending on the amount of people in there, you should get 150 to 200 points, uh, 50 being uh, each kill you get. Uh, I noticed I only got 100, kill, 100 points, so uh, I quickly dove down in and uh, started shooting in some more missiles, took out the other guy for that extra 50 points. So whenever you guys take out a tank or any uh, machine for any uh, sort, you want to fly around it for a bit and make sure uh, you can see the uh, runners, the guys who dodge out. And uh, I'm going to end it off here for you guys, uh, let you guys watch the rest on this. I hope you guys liked it. Uh, leave some comments and uh, check out my channel if you guys want to see some more. Uh, if you want to see the rest of this, I'm going to cut it short here. If you want to see the rest of this, uh, check out my channel. I'll have the second part to this. And I'll point out some more tips uh, for uh, taking down uh, guys with the heli. Hope you guys liked it and uh, thanks to Pistol Revive for uh, uploading this if they do. Uh, yeah guys, check it out.